After an earlier report that the River State Police Command has blocked the entrance to the River State Independent Electoral Commission, the police themselves have come out to say that that is not true. It is a lie. We didn't do that. But before we delve right into the details of today's news, if this is your first time here or you haven't subscribed to this channel, what are you doing? Please go ahead and subscribe. Like this video. It's very free. It's free of charge. If you don't even do anything on this channel, just hit the like button. The thumbs up you see, just, hit, just click on it. Like this video so that this video gets recommended to other YouTube viewers all around the world. Thank you very much as you support this channel. The River State Police Command has dismissed reports that its operatives have sealed off the office of the River State Independent Electoral Commission to stop them from conducting the local government council elections scheduled for Saturday. The police noted that the report was false, adding that its of operatives were there to maintain law and order. Tuesday, while the police dispersed youths who were gathering themselves to commence the scheduled protests in the state, some heavily armed officers had condoned of the River State Independent Electoral Commission office in Port Harcourt. It would be recalled that the Federal High Court sitting in Abuja and presided over by Peter Lufus had restrained the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, from releasing the voters' register used in the 2023 elections to the residents to the River State Independent Electoral Commission. Tuesday, there were reports that the police mobilization at River State Independent Electoral Commission office was to stop the election from holding on Saturday. But in a quick response, police dismissed the report stating that their men were there to avoid breakdown of law and order. The public relations officer of a command, Grace Irige Koko, superintendent of police, who was reacting to publication by some online platforms, that the office of River State Independent Electoral Commission was sealed by the police, clarified that the police officers seen at the River State Independent Electoral Commission office were posted to the police on the directive of a commissioner of police, Olatunji Disu. Ewege Koko said the policemen were there to protect the facility against any attack during the ongoing nationwide protest in Port Harcourt, advising people to always verify their facts before going to press. She further emphasized that there is no iota of truth in the allegation peddled on some social media platforms that the police assaulted and beat up some protesters. Um, according to reports as well, there have been reports that uh, pro uh, protests have turned violent in Port Harcourt and that protesters have been beat up and assaulted, which is what the police is now you know, denying, saying that none of that happened. Before we go, guys, let's take a look at some of the reactions we got online. Anero says, let it be as you have said, but to prevent officers of the commission from assessing their office will not all go well with you. Rivers is not the only state that's about to conduct a, a win all election that has, that has been the hallmark of various states. Even when the matters are in court, river states cannot be an exception. Adolphus Ishamau says, what kind of leader do we have? No truth, no sincerity, no integrity. Johnson says, good one. Please police boss in River State assist Fubara to give Riverians good governance he has started. Thank you very much, you all, for always listening and watching. Subscribe, like, all that good stuff. I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.